Hey, welcome to the official Windows 8 channel. And today we're going to show you how to copy and paste a article or some text from Internet Explorer browser into the WordPad on Windows 8. Well, sometimes saving an article, saving a part of an article, or maybe just a paragraph, is something that's um, interesting and useful and you can keep it in your computer and instead of saving a whole web page for example you can select what you want on the web page and do what we call a copy and paste to uh, actually take that text and send it to the wordpad which is a uh, basic word processor in windows 8 so how do you do that whatever browser you know, I say Internet Explorer in this video, but actually this is going to work pretty much with all browsers, Chrome, Firefox, Internet Explorer. And um, it's quite easy to do, but you have to understand how to do it because a lot of people just uh, get a little baffled when they're trying to do a copy paste. So open your web browser into the article that you want to copy or paste. So for example here I'm in an article in the Computer World um, website and I want to copy this article on my WordPad. Well usually to copy an article, for example if I want to copy the first part, let's say from about here, I'm going to put it in blue, so from here to uh, just here. So how do you do that? Well, you have to position your cursor or your arrow just at the good spot. So just to the upper left, for example, of the uh, article or the text. Then you'll click your left mouse button, but keep it clicked. Don't let go. Then go over the text and you see it becomes blue. And that's showing you that it's actually selecting the text. Now, some other text might actually be copied at the same time, but you can actually edit out once it's copied in your uh, word processor or your word pad. So once it's done, you can let go. And here's the tricky part. Go on the blue text. It's very important. You need to go onto the highlighted text. There you'll right click on your mouse and here you'll have search share or copy show up just click copy now this is probably where people once they master the first part they're a little baffled because like well I copy but nothing happens the reason is that the computer does not know what you want to do with this text it's waiting for you to tell it where it's going to copy so once you've done that go and get your word pad so for example I'll go here uh, in the search bar, in the charms bar, and I'll type word pad and then click on it. And here, all you have to do is right click somewhere in the blank page and paste. Just choose paste. And here you got it. You've got the full article that's been, or the uh, article, the part of the article you wanted in the page. Now, there was one part that I didn't want, which is here. So I can just remove anything I want by clicking the delete button over that text and keep only what I want to have, for example. So I can, you know, remove this if I want and just keep that. And here you've got your article. And now you can uh, save it to your computer. Click File, Save As, and, uh, you know, I'll just put Computer World Article and save it in my documents. There we go. I've got that article saved on my computer. It's quite easy, but it requires doing it and trying it a few times. It's not always um, the first time, especially the tricky part is, you know, going over the text, first of all, making sure you're not going too far in the text. That's the other problem very often. People go on the text but don't go too far. If you go up to the right side of the screen, you're going to have too much text. So you got to be careful. Some pages are easier to copy and paste than others. It depends on the browser. So this is the Metro version. But if I go into, uh, for example, my desktop version of Internet Explorer, 
and go into an article once again in the computerworld.com site. Um, for example, here. And I want to keep part of this article. All I have to do is simply, once again, I go into the upper left side just next to the first um, line of my paragraph. Click, hold, and then move downwards on that text up to the part where I stop. I will stop here. Right click once again on the blue or on the highlighted text. It's very important because if you click somewhere else, you're going to uh, take out the highlighted text. It's going to come back to normal. That's not what you want. So you have to go back on the highlighted text. And there you'll copy. And once again, just go into your word pad and, uh, you know, I'll make a new document. I'll right click in the blank page and paste. And here I've got the full paragraph that I've selected or the full text that I've selected copied in the word pad. You can save it to your computer. And this is a great way to actually take just part of an article and keep it for yourself. One little word of caution, it does happen that websites block copy paste because they don't want to uh, they don't want you to actually um, use that function because a lot of these articles are actually copyrighted. So it's very important not to actually um, to be careful not to use these texts somewhere else, first of all. And second of all, um, a lot of these are going to be uh, blocked on some sites because they don't want you to uh, use copyrighted material. So hope it helps. Hope you've learned how to copy and paste in the WordPad. And um, if um, this works pretty much with anything that has text in it, you just you know go over it, highlight it, and then copy and paste. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe to our channel. You'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments or questions on what you've seen, let us know. Maybe you have a feature, maybe you have a problem, you have something you'd like us to talk about for Windows 8. Let us know. We'll try to put that video online. And hopefully, you will come back to the official Windows 8 channel. Thanks for watching and hope to see you again. Bye-bye.